Hey y'all, hey y'all, hey, welcome back. Y'all already know for what. A quick little video. So with that being said, y'all, we gonna go ahead and we gonna jump right into this video. Y'all already know. I don't really do no videos on the life of Kiara or Desmond. But y'all, I happen to go ahead and slide on over there, you know, the uh, Desmond uh, channel. Y'all, when I tell y'all that was some bullshit, y'all. Okay. I was appalled about the shits that I saw. <laughs> Kiara. I have no idea why you would even be worried about anything that he is doing. I have no idea why you would even want to be caught in the same room or car as him. <laughs> Yo, when I tell y'all, <laughs> I couldn't believe it. I said, this man is a fucking clown. Not only is he a clown, but he's a bum. The man is a bum. A straight out, flat out bum. He would be an embarrassment to me. I wouldn't even let him come and pick up his kids. I would get in my car and drop them off at his house so nobody would even see him pulling up in my driveway apartment complex or anything, coming in my door, talking to me, picking up my kids. It ain't no way. First, let me say this right here. I have never, ever seen a man that is in the army that looks like him and what i mean by that is that when you are in the army as being what i'm an army brat still am okay dad was in the army for 26 years mm -hmm. yeah army brat spools all of that okay till this day most men that are in the army they have a certain you know what I'm saying? Way that they carry themselves. They don't come on the camera not shaved. They don't come on the camera looking disheveled. You know what I'm saying? Looking abused. Looking used. Looking like a complete homeless individual. No. They come on the camera cleanly shaved. All right. They have an upstandard about way they carry themselves. Even men in the army. Yeah. They even walk and talk with pride. That shit that I saw and encountered over there, I said, get the fuck out of here. How you look, how you talk, you are a bum. I mean, the man came on there showing his credit score. That was 400 and something. I ain't never heard no shit like that, I swear. I've never seen a man in the army look the way that he looks. He looks like the Unabomber or somebody. Yeah. When I tell y'all this shit got me when I went over there, I'm like looking at the videos, you know, and like how he, it, it, it was weird as shit to me, being as though, from someone being around a man that is in the army that has a certain way, you get me, that they put their underwear, their socks, their boxers in the drawer. Whereas though, you know, there's sheets on their bed and all of that. You know what I mean? Most of them, they iron their actual sheets. They will iron their boxers and t-shirts. You're not going to catch them looking a mess. Not at all. He going around driving in an old ass, dirty, dusty car where he doesn't have a battery, y'all. The battery goes out and what Desmond does is go to like an off shop or whatever. They reboot it, you know, give him the battery. You know what I mean? Reboot the battery, hot shot, whatever it is that you call it, right? And he's sitting in the car. As he's sitting in the car, the dashboard was so nasty and so 
dirty and disgusting and, 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 and had so much um, dust. I couldn't believe it. I couldn't believe it at all. I, I mean, this y'all probably like, why are you so upset? I'm telling y'all, I've never seen a man that is in the army carry himself in this manner. Not at all. It was it was disgusting. His and his officer, they need to just go ahead and let him out the army, cause he is a disgrace to the army. Definitely. They need to go ahead and let him out, take away his military ID. He shouldn't be able to go to the commissary, the PX, or none of that. All right. None of that. So the man gives him a high shot, and the man said, you know, you're going to have to get a new alternator because your car is going to cut off. So he is showing this. You get me? And then he goes, oh, well, I could just go ahead and get an Uber and pick up my son. I've never even seen a man in the army that is broke. I mean, he is broke. That's why he's on here creating videos. And all of his videos make entirely no sense. He looks like he is a ticking time bomb, okay? Anytime you go ahead and you get on this camera, the way that you look, you get on this camera, you show us your 400 and something credit score, you show us your car that, I mean, need, looks like it needs to be basically towed the fuck away and stay in car heaven. Coming on here saying that you don't have no money, I mean, I don't get it. Even though the new woman that you have pregnant, I don't even know how she could even lay next to you or even look at you. I mean, you look filthy. Filthy. Kiara, you should be running around dancing that you don't got to look or deal with that at all. Mm -hmm. You shouldn't be coming on this camera, Kiara, making any type of videos about him, okay? All right. Because it looks like if someone knew you and someone knew him, all right, um, and they know that you have a YouTube career, Kiara, I wouldn't want my YouTube career to have nothing involved with him, Okay. I don't really watch you or whatever. I seen a little bit of your videos and you be talking about him. Girl, if you don't go sit yourself down and never, ever, ever, ever make a video about him and go and find yourself someone who is actually worthwhile making a video about or with, Maybe y'all, hold up, hold up, hold up. Maybe when they was together, he looked completely different. Maybe. Because I'm telling y'all, this man looked like he belonged on Skid Row. <laughs> the man, let me tell y'all, I don't think y'all hear me. The man looks like he belongs on Skid Row. He almost looks like a goddamn panhandler. Y'all say Zolo look dirty. If you go over there and look at Desmond, y'all gotta tell me he look like he... Y'all. <laughs> when I tell y'all I went over there, y'all, I looked at a couple videos. I got my black fat ass off of there so fast. So fast, my head was spinning. And it's like, I've seen the videos that are created about Kiara and, you know, some of the stuff she's saying, you know, what was going on and everything. And I'm like, looking the whole time, I can't, still can't pay attention to those videos. The only thing I'm looking at is 
you are worried about him? He's a fucking bum. <sighs> mm. All right, y'all. That was a little bit much for me. I just had to go ahead and share that with y'all or whatever. I don't know if y'all watch him, her, whatever. But yeah, if somebody please go tell her to uh, go hide herself. Please go tell her to go into witness protection so she ain't even got to look at him. So with that being said, y'all, I'm going to see all of you beautiful people and what's the next video? Later.